You see, things have changed since you've been gone, Barry. You talk about organization? Wait till you see what we've done with the Internet. We've got every gang from Seattle to San Diego working together now. They're not competing anymore. They're consolidated. The only thing we lack is a little overall leadership. And that's where you come in. Because people out there, they've got a lot of respect for you, Derek. When you're ready, you ought to come and talk to me about it. Well, you can forget about that. I'm done with it, Cam. Yeah, well, I, mean, I know you grew out of that shaved head bullshit a long time ago. Thank God. I like your hair the way it is now. You see, that's what I mean, Derek. We're thinking bigger now. No more of this fucking grocery store. You're not listening to me. I am done with it. All that bullshit out there and all your bullshit, too. I'm out. I understand how you feel. I mean, you've just done some hard time. Don't you fucking talk to me about hard time. You don't know a thing about it. Hey, I've done mine. You didn't do shit. I found out about your little prison story. You did two months, and then you rolled over on two kids and let them go down for you. So don't feed me your fucking lies, Cameron. All right, this is stupid. I'm done. Look, you go cool off. Get laid. Do something. Get your head on straight, then I'll talk to you. Yeah, but it doesn't even really matter if I don't, does it? Because you got the next crop all lined up and ready to go, you fucking chicken hawk. Excuse me? You prey on people, Cam. You use them. I lost three years of my life for your fucking phony cause, but I am on to you now, you fucking snake. Hey, Gary, watch it. Be careful. Remember where you are. This is not some fucking country club where you can waltz in and out of here. Hey, shut up! Shut the fuck up! I came in here to tell you one thing. I am out. Out! And Danny is out, too. And if you come near my family again, I'm gonna fucking kill you. Well, excuse me, but fuck you, Derek. You can't come barking threats at me. Look, you can do whatever you want, but Danny is a good kid. He's not some whining pussy like you. He needs my help, and I'm gonna give it to him. If you come near Danny again, I will feed you your fucking heart, Cameron. I won't have to. He'll come to me. I'm more important to him now than he'll ever be. You're a fucking dead man, Vineyard.